okay so I am going to show you how to block unwanted websites via your wireless router uh, with that with that uh, procedure you're gonna be able to block all the computers and devices that connect wirelessly to your router so um, you only need to do it once you don't need to do it computer by computer and you don't you don't need to download any program that uh, have questionable origin uh, I've I have seen many a few videos on YouTube that in order to block websites they ask you to download a program which uh, you shouldn't do uh, you shouldn't be downloading unknown programs that m might very likely harm your computer and steal your uh, steal your financial information and take money from your take money from your credit card and uh, steal your identity and do a lot of uh, harm uh, in your financial life so the procedure that I'm going to show you is only going to require you to change change a couple of DNS addresses which are from Norton the company that makes the famous antivirus so on Google you're going to type Norton connect safe connect safe it's a uh, one word so click enter and uh, by the way you're not this is gonna be free and you're not even going to be required to open an account or sign up for anything so on the first entry dns.norton.com click on that it's gonna take you to this page click on get Norton for home and then on this little box right here you're gonna check it and you're agreeing that you're not going to use this for business purposes you're only going to use it at home so click get started and we're going to choose configure router uh, if you well I'm not going to go into that but uh, this is a different procedure configure PC we're going to click configure router so my router is a uh, Belkin and uh, the way I access the router from my browser I click I type the local IP address which is 192.168.2.1 uh, my last browser that was a Linksys I needed to type uh, 1.1 at the end so if uh, neither of two of those two addresses access your router you will need to check your user manual for your brand of router or you could you could even do a search on the internet to find out but for my Belkin brand I am going to type that address wait it hold on let's see there you go Belkin uh, you're gonna have to by the way this is called the control panel of the router so you're gonna have to log in uh, if your router is brand new and you never set a password before it most likely is gonna be this password right here admin that's for uh, a router that doesn't have a a password that you have changed before but if you have already 
change the password you're going to use that so once you enter your password it's going to allow you to make changes uh, you're going to see something similar to this LAN setup, internet one we want to click on DNS uh, your router most likely is going to have this box checked which is going to allow you to use your ISP's servers automatically but uh, we're gonna use Norton's so you're going to uncheck this box and we're going to enter the two addresses right here so we're gonna go back to Norton and uh, on the page that we saw before you're going to click the level C security which is a stronger level of security is going to block uh, malware websites, phishing, viruses, virus infected websites, uh, drugs, violence, gore, suicide, all that, garbage, pornography, uh, violence, most of the garbage of, on the internet is going to be blocked. Uh, maybe a few websites that Norton does not yet know about are gonna go through but pretty much you're gonna be your kids are gonna be pretty safe with this setting or your nephews or your uh, your friends kids or whoever lives in your house that you don't want to uh, accidentally uh, go into those websites so this is the first uh, DNS address and we're gonna copy that on the the first box right here 198.153.192.60 and the second uh, address you're gonna enter it on the boxes below secondary DNS address 198.153.194.60 uh, keep in mind that by the time you watch this video the addresses might have changed so make sure you are typing the correct ones so click apply and uh, your router is gonna do that and then uh, you are set uh, I'm going to type a couple of websites just to make sure that it is working Okay, this is a known uh, pornography website and uh, it is blocked and I'm gonna type a hate website it's gonna block webs websites that promote drugs, promote uh, alcohol and uh, gore there are some pretty nasty gore websites on the internet that have some pretty nasty and uh, violent pictures uh, i'm sure you wouldn't want your kids to watch all that all that shit on your computer so okay let's check this website right here all right so it is blocked this is a known hate website all right so that's it it was pretty easy uh, if you have any questions uh, let me know thanks